there are two really important trends that uh, we, we actually publish a uh, Asian American consumer report every year. And uh, there's two trends that we really talk about in this year's report. One is that Asian Americans adoption of new digital platform and uh, their influence on inclusive content. Uh, again, it is, it's all about, um, you know, using our power as consumers and uh, influencing what we see and what gets shown on screen, right? And then um, gaming. This was something that became really big uh, when COVID-19 hit and continues to be because kids are at home and parents are working and kids need to be uh, busy. And so there's a lot more time in gaming. And I say kids, but quite honestly, I think the average age is like 20 something. So it's not, we're not talking kids. Um, maybe a, a, lot of, a lot of people are just finding themselves at home uh, and being uh, gamers. But this is another area that is growing huge uh, and, and an, uh, an area in the industry that we really all have to keep an eye on and pay attention to. So, you know, as, um, as a media uh, measurement company, we at Nielsen, uh, we know more than probably uh, most about the streaming war that's happening, right? The proliferation of content. Um, I actually heard uh, CNN um, say that there, uh, there are 70 ways on digital for people to watch CNN today. 70 ways. So imagine the, the, the complexity of actually having to measure all of that, right? And gosh, as a consumer, like we can't, it's not, it's so much more complicated. Like gone are the days where you had like five channels and I'm really dating myself, but um, there wasn't a lot of choice. You go click, click, click. And then it's hopefully that one of them is something you might want to watch. But the choices, I get overwhelmed even just going into Netflix, but thank goodness they have those. Uh, I can customize it for mine versus uh, my 13 year old da daughter. But uh, in the Niel in Nielsen's report, we actually reported that in 2019, there were 646,000 unique content. OK, it's 400. And, and so just imagine uh, the massive amount of content and what that has done in not just in consumer changing and shaping consumer behavior, but also advertising. Right. So if you're an advertiser and you want to get in front of a certain type of person, like how do you even begin when you when you know that there is so much proliferation? of content. Um, we all, as we all know, um, we are early adopters of technology. So it's no surprise that Asian Americans are really more likely to be cord cutters. Uh, so if you look, look at here, uh, you know, we under index when it comes to traditional cable, um, but we over index into when it comes to broadband and the um, virtual multi channel video programming distributors. Uh, I have to say it probably uh, properly or my data scientists will shoot me. Um, but those are these are our new platforms like Hulu Live, like AT&T TV Now, YouTube TV, where you can actually access TV content in a streaming in a streaming platform.